Hello all and welcome back. Today we are going to create this beautiful infographic using PowerPoint. So let's get started. Let's first enable the guides and then format the background with any light color. I advise to have a blue shade in this light color. Next go to insert tab and then draw a rounded rectangle shape at the center of our slide. Make it completely rounded and then adjust the size if required. Now remove its outline and then duplicate this rectangle shape using Ctrl plus D. Now these are the important steps. Select the first rectangle shape and then go to shadow effects. Apply the outer shadow with top left effect. Now change the shadow color to white. Set the transparency to 50% and then increase the blur and distance values to 8 points. Now select the duplicate rectangle shape. Apply the outer shadow with bottom right effect. Now the shadow color must be darker shade of our background color. This is very important. Again set the transparency to 50% and then increase the blur and distance values to 8 points. Next select both the rectangles and then match their fill colors with the background. Align both the rectangles one over the other and that is how we get this beautiful effect. And this effect is called neomorphic effect in graphic design. Let's separate both the shapes and then go to insert tab. Select the oval shape and then draw a small circle holding down shift key. Remove its outline and then duplicate it using Ctrl plus D. Now instead of applying the same shadow effect to both the circles, let's make use of format painter and then apply the shadow effect of both the rectangles to both the circle shapes. Next align both the rectangle shapes one over the other and also circle shapes one over the other and then place them as per the design requirement. Before we start creating few more duplicates, let's first duplicate both the circle shapes and then separate them together. We can make use of the circles to apply format painter to other shapes if required. Next select the rectangle and circle shapes and group them together. Now create 3 more duplicates using Ctrl plus D and then place them one below the other as shown. Align all the shapes centrally to horizontal guide and then duplicate them using Ctrl plus D. Flip them horizontally and then place them as per the design requirement. Next go to insert tab and then draw a circle shape through center of slide holding down control and shift keys. Remove its outline. Match its fill color with the background and then apply inner shadow effect to this circle shape. Let's change the shadow color to the darker shade of our background color and then adjust the transparency and blur values until we get desired shadow effect. Next go to insert tab and then draw another circle shape through center of slide holding down control and shift keys. Remove its outline and then duplicate this circle using control plus D. Now making use of format painter, apply the shadow effect to both the circles as shown. Align both the circles one over the other and that looks perfect. 
delete both the small circles and then go to insert tab choose the elbow connector and then draw the line through center of circle to each of the design elements Select all the lines, group them together and then duplicate them using Ctrl plus D. Flip them horizontally and then align them to the right side design portion. Now ungroup all the lines, change the outline color and dash type. Finally, add all the PNG icons and text fields onto our design. Let's speed up to save time. So here is the final preview. Hope you all liked it. Please don't forget to like, share and comment. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.